choirs lifting their voices, musicians playing their hymns, the sounds of the holidays at our churches bring joy to so many. And one local woman has been sitting behind the organ at her church every Christmas for 70 years. Kim Gable met up with her as she rehearses for a milestone weekend on a positive note tonight. Rehearsals really aren't necessary for Shirley Schmuck. She is an accomplished and admired musician, and she admits a born natural. Yes, mother said I could just go to the piano and pick up tunes, and I played by ear. But a very important weekend is upon this 91-year-old as the Hilltop United Methodist Church in Allentown prepares to celebrate Christmas and Christmas Eve. And Shirley herself will be celebrating her 70th year as the organist for those services. I was baptized here when I, that was 91 years ago. <laughs> And I've been a member ever since. Every Sunday, except for vacation or illness, we were at this church. Faith and music were at the center of Shirley's life, even as a young girl. As a teen, her devotion and talent made the congregation take notice. And that's her, front and center, right near the massive pipes that once bellowed harmonious hymns as the worshipers sang. In 1952, she was asked to be the permanent organist and choir director. And I agreed. And it was a little difficult at first because the members of the, or, of the choir were probably my mother's age. <laughs> <laughs> so that was a little daunting. The church was filled at the, in those years, just packed with people. And, and I just loved doing it. And she has shared her gift, teaching many of her family members how to play, including her grandson, John. Members delighted in their duets on special occasions. And her portrayal of Mrs. Claus at the holiday parties brought joy to the children. Pastor Dylan Parsons says she's made an impact on every member of the congregation in some way. Everybody here. Um, and this church is just a uniquely welcoming place. I doesn't matter who walks in off the street, everyone is welcomed with open arms. And I think Shirley has been a large part of setting that tone mm -hmm. for 91 years now. Um, and that character is really deep into this place. There are about 30 members in the pews during most services these days. I look forward to it every Sunday, no matter who's here. Big or small crowd, doesn't matter. They're all here to worship God. And for Shirley, her ministry comes through her music. The, the words of the songs have such meaning, deep meaning. And I think when they leave church on Sunday, they can carry that me message with them all week long. A mission 70 years in the making. That's all we can hope for. That's the best that we could possibly hope for. With a pianist who's brought harmony and hope to generations, this is Kim Gable on a positive note.